John, yeah. I know this was important. Uh, you called me. You asked if you could come out here and talk about this. What is your problem with the NBA? Well, as a fan of the NBA, as we all were, mm -hmm. um, they kind of left us in the dark for two months. They yeah. took something away from us. They left us with a certain emptiness, a certain sadness. And uh, the NBA, of course, has promised to make it up to us. But what I decided to do, because I don't know if I believe that with two lockouts in the past 14 years, so what I decided to do was to go out and find a league that cares about its players and respects its fans like this audience as well. The All greatest right. audience I've ever seen. The greatest. So did you find you... You went out and looking uh, for, a, for a league that would respect the fans. Did you find such a league? I did find a league. Here, watch this. What's your name? Micah. Micah? Micah. And how do you spell Micah? M-I-C-A-A. Oh, with letters? Yeah. Oh, gotcha. How much were the tickets to today's game? Zero dollars. You don't have to pay a cent to watch the game? Uh, nothing. That's great, because then you don't have to go into your piggy bank, right? I know. So you're here to watch basketball as well? Uh, well, mostly yes, but I'm interested in other things like... Like the black holes in space and underwater and stuff like that. How much do you get paid to play in the league? Zero dollars. I didn't get paid at all. You don't get paid a cent? No. To play in the why do you do it then? For fun. <laughs> yeah. Are you a communist? Do you ever fear that this league will be locked out, much like the NBA was? Mm. Have you ever been locked out of the house? Oh, yeah. What's that feel like? Feels like my little brother's trying to keep me out of the house. And you would never let the fans of this league have that feeling, would you? Nope. No, because you... Play. And... Uh, I don't know what you're looking for. With... <laughs> my team. And... Um, Twelve, exactly. <laughs> Have you guys ever met before this season, the two of you? Yeah, we're twins. You're what? We're brothers. Your brothers? And my voice is different. Your voice is different than his? Well, say something. Eh. Uh, eh. Uh. Yeah, it does sound a little bit different. You're right about that. Why do you think the commissioner of this league and the players have such a harmonious relationship? Because they're small and they don't know what they're doing. How tall are you? Um, I'm about four foot three. Four three? Is that right? Oh, I guess so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Are you guys nervous that one of the players on the other team is four foot three? Yes. That would terrify me. How great is it that this basketball league has never locked out its players? Locked out. I mean, they've never... Restricted any players? Restricted? In a sense, yes. They've never... They've always been able to come to an agreement with their players so that the game can go on oh, and the yeah, fans can yeah. watch it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, right. because, yeah, because I know. fans watch it. It's fun to watch basketball. I mean, it's almost as fun as playing video games. What are you guys going to do now? We're going to play date with Gregory. You're going to have a play date with Gregory? Yeah, right there. That sounds like fun. So after a wonderful day of basketball, you're going to have a play date. Yep, and maybe a sleepover. Right. Are you guys going to call your girlfriends and tell them that you won no. the... No. I don't even have one. You don't have a girlfriend? Do you have a girlfriend? We're nine. So you don't make any money playing in the league? Nope. Well, then you'd probably be pretty open to a sneaker sponsorship. Um, I don't know if you'd be interested, but Conan O'Brien... <laughs> has put out his own shoe. This is the Air Coco. It has, uh, of course, the red hair follicle sole and the double Windsor tie tone. Yeah. Would no, you... thank you. No? Conan O'Brien has come out with a new basketball sneaker, and I'm going to show it to you right now. <laughs> Look at that face, by the way. Do you like that? Yeah. Well, you, well, we'll pay you to wear it, but you got to promise to wear it everywhere you go. I'm not wearing it everywhere. Well, then you're not getting the sneaker. Get out of here! Because we're done!